In this video, I will be showing you what to do if the Touch ID no longer works on your iPad Air after the iPad OS 13.6 update. It seems like many iPad owners have encountered some issues with the Touch ID shortly after the iPad OS 13.6 update. Some have a hard time unlocking their devices using their fingerprints, while others can no longer get into their iPad. If you have a problem like this, here's what you need to do. First solution, force restart your iPad. If the Touch ID has been working properly prior to the update, then the problem could be just due to a pretty minor firmware issue. The first thing that you have to do is the forced restart. It's a simulated battery removal that has been proven effective against issues like this. Here's how it's done. Press and hold the home button and the power key for 10 seconds. This will trigger your iPad to turn off and power back up. When the Apple logo shows, release both keys and wait until it finishes the restart. When the reboot is complete, try to see if the Touch ID is now working properly. Second solution, set up a new Touch ID. There are times when the Touch IDs you've registered on your device gets corrupted. When that happens, your iPad may not be able to recognize your fingerprint. But you can definitely set up a new Touch ID, so that must be the next thing you need to do. Especially if the first solution failed to fix the problem. To do so, launch settings from the home screen. Scroll down to find Touch ID and passcode, and then tap on it. If prompted, enter your passcodes. Tap Add a Fingerprints. Now, follow on screen instructions to create a new Touch ID. After that, test the device to see if it recognizes the new fingerprint. If you want, you can also remove the old Touch IDs. Third solution, factory reset your iPad. If the problem continues after the previous solutions, then you have no other choice but to reset your iPad. A reset should be able to fix this problem, but before you actually do that, make sure to create a backup of your important files as they will be deleted. When ready, follow these steps to reset your iPad. From the home screen, tap Settings. Tap General, if it's not selected yet. Find and then tap Reset. Tap Erase All Contents and Settings. Tap Erase Now. If prompted, enter your security locks. Tap Erase. Tap Erase again to proceed. Now, enter your Apple ID password, and then tap Erase to proceed with the reset. Wait until your iPad has finished the reset, and then set it up as a new device. If you think that this video is helpful, we would appreciate it if you can like, share, subscribe, and hit the notification bell for more videos in the future. Thanks for watching.